I believe in God the Father. I believe in Jesus Christ. I believe in the Holy Spirit, and he's given me new life. These are lyrics to one of my favorite worship songs, and I believe it really sums up exactly what I have confidence in. I live for those words, and to me, they're real. Throughout my life, I've endured hardships along with celebrated times of complete joy. In those moments, I develop my faith in the Lord Jesus Christ. Only through him do I have hope. I was raised in a Christian home by my mother and father, a happy home and nothing short of ordinary. But when my dad left at age 16, all of that happiness faded away. I was left wondering, and even still wondering today, why my own father would suddenly change his mind about his family. But life kept moving. I got into a serious relationship with a terrible guy. I went to school with him, and I did everything I could to find happiness through him. The same happiness that went away with my dad. For two very long years, I was lied to, hurt emotionally and physically, and fought through depression and severe anxiety and trying to figure out why I wasn't good enough. But I stayed regardless. At least someone was there. In early 2012, a friend invited me to church, something I'd for years tried my hardest to stay away from. Why would they want me if no one else did? But later that year, on August 29th, I found Jesus. He was presented to me in a way I'd never seen him before, loving, forgiving, and gracious. It was then that I realized how much he loved me, how he never had and never would leave me. I asked him to be my savior, and that's just what he did. He immediately cleared my life of any negative influences, which included friends and family. It was super hard to let go of certain people, but he has never taken anyone or anything a way that he hasn't replaced with something ten times better. Since then, I've found healing from that bad relationship and even reconciliation with my dad. Times can still be hard, and forgiveness is still a daily process, but I have peace in knowing that God is still God and God is still good. I have joy that has been given to me that I cannot explain. The best is yet to come.